Zeltner. He's actually beat Tina Zeltner within uh, Osai Komi. We were quite lucky to have um, Tatiana Flada to come and uh, tell us about that. She also told us a little bit about the shimiwaza that Zeltner had used on her first opponent. That was the uh, Ukrainian. So they're, they're, these girls now are into the uh, quarterfinal stage. Yeah, quarterfinal, which yeah. Is essential for uh, having the opportunity to fight for a medal. Yeah. You have to reach the last eight under this uh, competition format. Uriarte is on um, mat number four against Dragon Uriarte of Spain, the former European champion, and Dmitry Dragon. Yeah, Dragon had a hard match against uh, Ivanov, uh, the Bulgarian, uh, in the first round. He went into golden score, and then Dragon got it. But that was a tough one for him. Mm. You don't want that too early, do you? Or no. too often. There's uh, Vechta with the Uchimata attempt. Can't quite bring it off. Bukovala proving too strong. She's got that bleached blonde streak right down the middle of her head. Bukovala easily recognizable. Are the numbers in the bracket, uh, do that signify the round that they're fighting in or something else? I guess it's the rounds. Uh, I think that's the third round, yeah. We've got uh, a display giving the names and uh, countries doesn't have their seeding in there because you can only have so much information <laughs> Pavia's going to fight um, well we're not sure who she'll fight it's the winner of this match that's right the winner of this match will fight Autumn Pavia but we've got the line up for the um, rest of the under 57 kilo category and given that we're watching that we may as well just go through that it'll be uh, um, Thelma Montero to fight uh, Karakash Hedvig Miriam Roper will face Sarah Loco Sarah Clark will fight Tugba Zahir and then Autumn Pavia will fight the winner of this contest between Lulieta Bukovala of Greece and Viola Vechta of Germany this is a good, um, good group, under 57s. Karakash seems to be on uh, good form. She's seen off both of her opponents this morning and she finished both of them off with uh, trademark Nivas up. She's got her hands full with the next one, with uh, Montero. Well, the, uh, the good thing for um, Karakash is that um, it's in Nivas that she is uh, proficient. And maybe, I mean, we all know what uh, Montero's thoughts on Nivas are. <laughs> so she very does. difficult to get her down there though. Yeah, that's it. And she uh she does throw really well. Yeah, that looks like uh, a good match. That's the first of the quarterfinals. A little bit too far away with the first attack. That was a better one. But, uh, you know, a score was given for that. For me, that was just a... Rolled from a the roll, ground. Fro roll on the ground, yeah. That was never a throw. But uh, there you go. It's been given. Mm -hmm. Increases the lead now. Wazari with uh, just under two minutes to go. Vesta with a, a big job on her hands. Oh, she's gone. Bukovala finishes it off now. Oh, no argument beautiful. about that one. That was a lovely technique. It's a beauty.
Bukavala wins by Ippon. Adriana Kitsu has just uh, thrown.